setting year in the PBA won nearly $300,000 one year. Coming up next, ABC's Wide World of Sports as we look at Tammy Albee. You'll see the same kind of beauty and artistry at the United States Figure Skating Championships. Presented by Visa. Todd Eldridge tries for his third U.S. title in the men's final live this afternoon. And then tonight, you're looking at Olympic medalist Nancy Kerrigan, dueling former champion Tanya Harding, and Nancy trying for her first ladies' crown. It's after us, the men's ABC Sports, the ladies tonight. Open in the fifth frame on the left-hand lane, and here in the seventh frame, he is giving himself. He needs to get the ball to the right of the three-pin. Three drives into the seven. The ball will take out the six. If he doesn't make it, the match is right down to less than 20 pins. All out for it, Mike Albee. So here in our title game in Las Vegas, get closer. We'll be back. Trailing now of only 16, spare up seventh frame. Got a hook. Boy, you heard Parker in the microphone he's wearing say, you got a hook, and the ball did. Head pin flying to the right sideboard and sails back right in front of the seven. That's two frames in a row he's gotten a bad break. Sixth frame was a solid seven. Seventh frame, a light seven. But he has shown that he can hit this pair and string some strikes. Remember, the winner will meet the king of the hill, Ron Williams, who is practicing from the right side. Mike Albee, 143 pace through seven frames. Parker Bone, a potential two. I'm sorry, Albee has 143 through seven. Bone with a strike would be 126, 17 pins behind, yet three big frames left. No. Well, completely unsettled on lane 59. That doesn't make any difference which one of the left-handers have been out here. We see the right-handers when, when Ron Williams comes in. It'll be lane 60 that has been the key for the righties over the years. If he can hit 60, he'll be competitive. Now getting up is a 32-year-old that won his first title, the PBA National, when he was 19 years and 95 days old. He's won 19 more since Player of the Year 1985, Mike Albee. Eighth frame. Well, Albee's in an elite company, Chris. You mentioned he's won 20 PBA titles. And here's the other players that have won 20 titles. It's Earl Anthony, Dick Weber, Marshall Holman, Mark Roth, Don Johnson, and Dick Retker. Add Mike Albee to that. Just seven players have won 20 titles. That is an elite group. There is Tammy. Tammy Albee, mother of Chris. Lefties, Earl Anthony winning 41. Mike Albee second in line with 20. Then Dave Davis, Steve Cook, and Johnny Petraglia, 14. You want to show you how confused a player is, Albee, you could hear the microphone for him to yell for that ball to hook. Now, he, look at this. He's yelling hook right now, and he thinks it needs it to hook a little bit more, and he didn't realize it would break that much, and he almost less the 6-7-10 split. That's when you're confused. You should be yelling stop and not hook. Albee, the full grip, easy spare, the six pin. Mike Albee, whose hobby is collecting the bowling balls with which he wins tournaments. Well, right now, he might not have a ball to collect if Parker Bone has anything to say about it. Bone, still in the match, needs to throw three strikes to take the lead. Wow. Got a great shot that was. Uh, a cruel game. Well, he's just mumbling to himself. The two, four, seven, eight, 
Once again, that is the combination that's given him trouble all week. He missed the 2-7 split earlier in this match. And this is one spare he's really got to work on because he cannot win if he doesn't make it. <laughs> Barring a gutter ball or a foul by Albi, if Bone does not strike here twice in a tenth, it's all over. So let's rephrase that. It's mandatory that Parker Bone strike on the next two shots. Well, Albi knows the score. Parker's face tells the score. Disappointing for Parker Bone. Mike Albee just needs four pins and stay behind the foul line. The first shot, he'll become his 21st title and go on to meet Ron Williams in the shootout. That's a winner right there. Only pro to be Rookie of the Year and Player of the Year. Amazing record by this young man. He has won five titles at the showboat, never has lost a match on this championship pair, and now he has the 1993 title, and he'll be go against Ron Williams for the King of the Hill Championship next game. Leaving a 6-10, and this the championship match in Las Vegas. Tammy's sister is married to another left-hander, professional Steve Cook. Two on three to 180. ABC Sports.